Hey everybody, my name is Megan and I am very excited today for a couple of reasons. The first one is I got this cup in the mail. It's um, it's a Wicked Cup and there's a story about this kind of. I went to go see Wicked in New York um, around, I want to say it was Christmas Eve with my best friend and I bought a mug but on the plane ride back home the mug broke and I was very upset so I got this surprise in the mail today I'm assuming it's for my mom because uh, she sends me stuff and I also sent her a message that she said thank you and she knew what I was talking about so obviously it's probably from her I'm also very excited because I got Bobos in the mail today there is the little robot um, this is the July box, and I got it today, September 1st, which if it, if it were any other box besides Bobos, that lateness would be very disappointing, but because it's Bobos, I don't mind, because if you don't know about Big Ol' Boxes stuff, it's basically just a small family, a mom, dad, a daughter, and a cat, and they have about 500 subscribers that they have to go and by they individualize each and every package so they have to do that for 500 people and mail it and they just started a Kickstarter I believe um, some type of crowdfunding site thing and I will leave that in the description so that if you want to help out Bobos you can and I think everybody should because uh, they're a great company and they pay like for everything themselves like I don't know they're just a really cool company and like anyway I'm gonna open this box I'm excited it's a little light which is okay I'm sure it's gonna be a great box uh, my dog is trying to eat my chair which I don't know why he's doing that okay I want to be surprised I'm not gonna look stop eating the chair go away my other dog is jealous. So we got paper. And more paper. Okay. Here we go. First up. It's a Hunger Games foil pack thing. I got one of these in my box last week. I mean, not last week. The previous month that I got Bobos. Um, so I'm going to open it and see who I got. I also got one of these in my Hastings haul video. Okay, so here I have this guy. Let me show you. Ah, the, the guy from District 11. What are you barking at? Okay, um, I forgot his name. Is, is it? He's the, the one that helps um, Katniss because she was friends with Rue, but I forgot his name. Is it Thra Thrash? Thrash? Is that even the right person? Anyway, here he is. I think these are really cool. So I'm excited about that. I think that's him. I'm probably completely wrong. Alright, next up is Pop figure of Wicket from Star Wars. So that's cool. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not like the biggest fan of Star Wars, but I did put it on my my little questionnaire thing, which is fine. I have a lot of friends that love Star Wars, and it's not like I don't like Star Wars. It's just that I've never actually seen all the movies, so that's my fault. I'm sure once I do see the movies, I will love it, and I will probably love Wicked. Um... I should watch the movies, I know. Okay, next up. We got something. Oh, look, we got Beth from The Walking Dead. I did put The Walking Dead on my questionnaire, and I love The Walking Dead. And Beth, here, there she is. Hopefully you can see her face. I know I'm like moving around a lot. Um, I like Beth. I thought her last story arc was really interesting. R.I.P. to Beth. Um, yeah, 
so that's really cool. My dogs are still fighting. I'm really happy with that. My favorite character is Carol, but I don't even think that they make, like, this type of figure of Carol, or at least I haven't seen one. If they do, someone let me know so I can get it. Okay. Uh, my dog is annoying. Okay, so it feels like a magnet. Here we go. It is a magnet. A Nightmare on Elm Street 3 Dream Warriors. So that's pretty cool. Um, they have like a horror section to fill out, and I am a fan of horror and uh, a Nightmare on Elm Street movie, so that's really exciting. And I love magnets. I like receiving magnets. Okay. Sorry about that. I feel a pin. Oh, it's Hagrid. That's so cute. I love it. Little Hagrid and his motorcycle glasses. I love Harry Potter and everything Harry Potter related, so I'm very happy about that. Okay, a piece of paper. Okay, so it's just letting me know that this is the second box for my three month Bobo subscription. And then they wrote a little note that says, Sorry for the delay, Team Bobos. That's okay, Team Bobos. I think I did email them asking about the delay, but it's just because I wanted the box. I promise I was not trying to be annoying. I feel candy of some sort. Ha ba 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 bubble gum. <laughs> and it's soft, so it's not old. That's good. The bubble gum that their flavor only lasts for like 10 seconds. Alright, I think there's like some comic books and stuff in here. Um, I'll save that for last. There are some comic books. Alright. This is exciting. <laughs> okay. I love this. So Bobos has sent me three comic books. And they're all Spider-Man. So we have this spectacular Spider-Man. There we go. These... Are these in sequence? Yeah, they are in sequence. Okay, so this is 191 of the Spectacular Spider-Man. This is 192 of the Spectacular Spider-Man. There we go. And this is 193 of Spectacular Spider-Man. That's really cool. Um. Spider-Man is my favorite superhero of all time. I love Spider-Man and anything related to Spider-Man. I'm so happy with this. And I love that they send the comic books in sequence. So 191, 192, and 193. This is really cool. I don't even, I'm a little bit speechless to be honest. So I have the Puma part one, part two, I have the Puma. Okay, so this it's the completed storyline of I have the Puma, part one, part two, and the conclusion. Man, I don't even know what to say right now. I'm very happy. I put Spider-Man slash Peter Parker as one of my favorite characters of like all time. So this, I don't, I don't know. I'm just really happy. This is really cool, and everything else I got was really cool. I especially like these, and my little Hagrid pin, that's awesome, and Beth, that's pretty cool too. And it it kind of looks a lot like her. Okay, anyway, um, so, I, I don't know, I'm just really happy, I really am. Um, I think Bobos is amazing. If you have not checked them out or subscribed to them before, you definitely should. Uh, and again, I'm going to put their crowdfunding support thing in the link below. Or not, yeah, in the description below so that you guys can donate if you would like to. Um, and I have one more box left of this subscription era. Um, but I. I'm definitely going to subscribe again. I need to do that this month because the August box would have been my last one. So I need to subscribe for September. Okay, I'm going to do that this weekend if I don't forget. Don't let me forget. Like, 
write me comments saying, Megan, don't forget to subscribe. And I think this little announcement is about their Kickstarter. So it says, Bobo has an announcement. Um, so, basically, thank you to all our subscribers for the love and support since they've opened our doors on March 30th, 2015. Um, so, yeah, we humbly ask you to consider supporting our Kickstarter campaign. So, yeah, um, <laughs> so it, is, it says, Bobos is a family-run business made up of three people, me, Robert, my wife, Noelle, and our 12-year-old daughter, Judy. Oh, and I almost forgot our chief supervisor, our cat, Cosmo. So it really is just like a small company if you want to consider that. I'd really say it's a family more than a company. And I think a lot of Bobo subscribers feel like part of the family. Um, and I think they're really, they are getting a lot of support on their Kickstarter, but they could use all the support that they can get. I have not yet donated, but I will this weekend when I subscribe to my Bobos and they have um, some really cool gifts or I don't know what they're calling Kickstarter like if you donate so much money then you get something in return which is pretty cool um, but yeah I just recommend donating what you can if you can um, and if you can't donate if you're a little low on money and funds then it always helps to spread the word about the Kickstarter um, and about Bobos. The more support they get, the better, in my opinion. I think that's probably in everybody's opinion. Because um, they really are a great company and they're always nice. Or they always have been to me at least. Um, and I'm really happy even though it was a, a delayed box. I think it was worth it. Um, and now I'm going to wait on my August box, but it, I mean, I really am okay with waiting for a box that is this cool. Okay, anyway, I'm going to stop talking. Um, but I hope that you guys are all having a great day. And let me know what you think about the items in the box and what you think about Bobos. Uh, and if you have any Bobos unboxing videos, let me know and I will check them out if you would like me to. Um, Alright, bye!